Hi everyone, I'm Andrea, welcome to my channel. Today we're gonna put to the test these two mascaras uh, they're really talked about in the uh, beauty industry. One of them is from um, Essence, it's the Essence Lash Princess, and then the other one is the uh, Falsies Lash Lift from Maybelline. So I'm gonna do this one here and this one here, and we're just gonna see how it's gonna look. To begin with, the um, Lash Princess is bristles. Uh, the bristles are regular. They're not silicone is what I'm trying to say. Um, it's like a cone shaped. So I know that a lot of people love these. I actually have the waterproof and it's really, really good for summer. It holds up really good. So we'll see how this one does. It's um, the one that's quite thin and little, which it's not bad. Uh, it could actually help you not make a lot of mistakes on your skin because when the wand is a little big you kind of it's kind of kind of touches things that you might not want to touch hmm quite easy to apply it deposits a lot of good um good amount not a lot a good amount of mascara on the lashes i'm gonna go on the lower lash lens too Actually, it does really well. It separates nicely too. It is new. This is my first time trying it. So we're trying it together and we're gonna wear the whole day and see how they, how each of them wear compared to each other. Okay. Just make sure they're looking how I want them to dry. When you get onto the last ones on the edge here, do pull them out. That makes your eye look much bigger. I think they look really nice. Well, Princess Lash, really good so far. Let's try the other one. The Falsies Lashes. Okay, this wand, it's a little different than that one. Um, it's not a cone shaped. I've seen this shape a lot. Um, it's like a thick at the edge and then comes a little dip and then a little uh, the same length uh, bristles on the other side so it's kind of like I don't know like a I don't even know what to say I was gonna say like a balloon but it's not all right let's see these ones they're both in black I I prefer a black mascara if I'm gonna put it on um, might as well just have the darkest I'm definitely making a, a little more of a mess on this side. And the formula seems to be a little more wet than the other. It deposits more on it, more on the lashes. Kind of clumped a little bit the uh, ones underneath the lower lashes on my lower bottom. Okay, so because of that, I'm gonna take a, um, just some uh, mas a mascara wand that I've cleaned up when I finished and I just, I'm just gonna separate them like this. Yeah, much better, same on the bottom. Okay, let's see now, let's see the effect. It took very little to put them on. Didn't take long at all. They are new, so they have a lot of, you know, it's, they're, they're wet enough to where I can just put it on and it um, definitely um, coats them nicely. I feel like I need to straighten this up a bit more. Okay. They are different, but not that different, actually. I feel like they both pretty much look the same. They feel like they, 
they're kind of the same length too. That also could depend on your lashes actually, how long the lashes are. Sometimes some lashes are, are longer than others and also depends from eye to eye. They can kind of twist or they turn or they are more um, curved or straighter. So that will depend too. But so far it seems like everything pretty much looks the same. There is more mess on this side than there is on this side. Not gonna blame the mascara because it could just be me, but it's very easy to clean. I mean, came off really easily. Have a little bit here, side, a little bit underneath here. Cleans up really fast. Let's see, a little bit here. Got a little chunk there, but not a big deal really. And a little bit thing here. Okay, all right. Do we see a difference? I actually think they look pretty the same. I do kind of like this one though. They, they seem more organized. <laughs> These lashes seem more organized. Like they feel like it's the same amount of coat on it and the same amount of like space in between to where this one sticks him a little more gathered it's from what I can gather here. I don't know if I can do anything else now because they've dried. All right, well, I guess we're gonna have to see how they wear and how they act throughout the day. So, so far, so good. Um, I'll come back later to kind of check in with you guys and see if they smushed or anything. I did set my eyes. I use um, the foundation that I used today. I used it underneath and on top. And then I set my foundation with the um, uh, Tatcha Silk um, powder, the uh, translucent one. So um, we'll see how it does. They should both, you know, the skin underneath is the same. So we'll see how, it, how they wear. And um, yeah, I'm excited to see which one wins. So I'll see you later. Five hours in with these um, lashes on, with these mascaras. Let's see how everything is um, doing. So I took a, I got a little pick in the mirror earlier, and I could tell that these lashes are kind of kind of a little wanky. I didn't mess with them, but they're a little out of place. They kind of went the way they wanted to. It could have been that I messed with them I unconsciously. I did not do it purposely. This one's kind of moved too. Um, I did set my under eyes and the top just to make sure there's no transfer. I helped the mascara as much as possible because with it touching, uh, it definitely transfers if uh, your um, if your oils are broken through or all that. So any little help, any little thing helped. Um, now I did mess with this right now. You can see you could see that, but and and now they're like back to their wonky stage. So I don't know what makes it. Okay. I don't know. But as far as a transfer, I see a tiny, 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 tiny bit up here. Um, a tiny bit up here. But not much, actually. It's, it's quite clean underneath. It's quite clean. I'm gonna do clean it up right now. Just that and these that was it not seeing anything else i see a little flick hair but i'm not sure if it's from mascara for me just gonna move them around or what but um i wasn't there earlier it's definitely um it's definitely looking nice both of them like i said these ones are still like doing their own thing it could just be and here goes the garbage <laughs> i'm just waiting for it and they're gone so um, I think I still think they look nice, but I kind of kind of preferred the way these ones look. I just like the way they're like really nice and they just they're just keeping their shape and form and all that. They're still like flattery. Um, yeah, I, I like it a lot more than these ones. I'm gonna go up here like this so you can kind of see them laying against the skin. <sighs> But yeah, um, so far so good, five hours in and they're looking great. So I'll see you at the end of the day though with more updates. Hey guys, um, it is past nine o'clock 
and uh, we'll see how the um, mascaras have um, behaved during the day. So I, <laughs> I kind of was bothered by this sun because it, no matter what I did with it, it really wouldn't stay properly. Uh, I guess that it's just either dried that way and it stayed that way, or just I don't know. I don't know what it was, but it definitely did not want to stay uh, nicely, no matter what I did. Now this one, on the other hand, the um, Princess Lash. Princess Lash actually looks so much better. I'm gonna get in close. Hope the light is kind of good in here, hopefully. But um, the Lash Princess stayed the same. I mean, it's got the same nice um, flutter. It didn't really do anything. I do see that there's some, like a little um, remnants i guess it kind of came off up here but it's been a long day uh not so much on this one but i do see it up here like at the end of the the corner of the eye but um uh, man different this one really stayed the same way it did really really good it didn't move it didn't budge it didn't nothing um this one not so much oops sorry Ooh, i'm shaking you uh this one even though it does look nice um it's just it clumped and it just did not want to unclump no matter what I did it would stay for a little bit and then it would just go back to clumping together so I don't know I don't know what that is um that's not to say that this one looks bad it does not look bad it, it held the curl and it held all that it's just now that I'm comparing uh we gotta be fair and just note the differences but yeah so far um I do like both of them but I gotta say this one's my favorite so I don't know what you like what's your favorite but Maybe I'll do it again with different switch them. Switch the eyes. I don't know. Maybe. Anyways, guys, um, this is it for today. I will uh, put on the screen uh, the amount of time that I wore these um, both uh, mascaras together. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Now I'm going to go jump in the shower and then just get it over with the day. Start new fresh tomorrow. Bye, guys.